I'm not you again. Would you just give me a timpani roll, please? Can we have a new drummer, please? Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, despite numerous complaints to the local police department, Showbiz Pizza Place fearlessly presents America's favorite uncle, it's the Apple Plunk Abomination! <laughs> It's a beautiful day for another great Uncle Clunk show. And boy, have we got a really swell show for you today. In fact, in just a couple of minutes, we'll be talking with the world's foremost authority on the stuff you're eating right now. <laughs> and I'm not referring to the napkin you're chucking on there, young fella. <laughs> Stop that. You don't know where it's been. <laughs> beautiful and actually I'll be interviewing the world's greatest expert on pizza live right here on the talk line now let's see hmm. well let's see who that is <laughs> I get to ask all sorts of strange people you know hello you're on the air with Uncle Clunk Oh, I get it. You're doing your impression of a telephone ringing. <laughs> well, that's very good. Do you do any others? Oh, no, that sounds like the phone ringing again. <laughs> what are you, some kind of nut? Oh, <laughs> I'd say you were more some kind of fruit, actually. <laughs> but you still have appeal. <laughs> I guess I'm too smart for the house. <laughs> What'd you expect, Johnny Carson? <laughs> okay, well, let's try it again, all right? <laughs> Hello? You're on the air. Yeah, hi. <laughs> no, this isn't. This is the Uncle Clunk Abomination. No, what? The Uncle Clunk Abomination. No, is it? <laughs> well, I'm Uncle Clunk. Johnny Carson. I'm glad you're so happy. <laughs> 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 Uh -huh. Well, uh, do you have a question or something I can answer for you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got a question. Okay. 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 Okay.
Who has a mighty name for sure. Oh, we know. By the ancient of painting on the cable walls of the show Man of the Faith with his mouth on fire. So, well, what does that mean? It means that whenever a pipe and food peaks a light out of the volcano, all in our case of the orb, that's a bunch of bad. Oh. Here's the Kotinka. I see. Well, can you tell us when Pizza came to America? Oh, sure. That's easy. It was in 1492 when Columbus sailed to America. No, wait a minute. I thought Columbus came to America by accident. Hey, don't believe everything you read. It's in the history books, huh? Columbus was running a very profitable pizza delivery franchise for the Queen Isabella Pizza Parlor. Columbus, he was doing very well. Three ships are waiting. So, in 1492, Columbus, he gets a call from a secret chief of somebody or other in America who was having a really big old powwow. And he ordered 600 pepperoni pizza with a order garlic bread on the side. So, Columbus, he load up all of the ships. He took all three. And six months later, he brings the food to the big party. Well, they all are singing and dancing, having a great time. But they've been smoking the pizza pipe so long, they don't even remember making the order. So here's Columbus with 600 pepperoni pizzas and the garlic bread. And nobody got any one of them because they already spent it on a tiny bit of food. Gee, so things do happen. That's very uh, interesting, Pete. Uh, but I'm afraid we're all out of time on today's show. Pete, can I have your back? My back? No, you can't have my back. I'm using it to hold up my shirt, huh? No. No, I mean, I mean, can, can we have you back on the show again sometime soon? Oh, for sure. Call again at a time. Reach out and touch someone. Uh, but just don't touch me. Relax, huh? <laughs> well, we won't. <laughs> and one more little thing. Sure, Pete, anything. What? How you can talk to me on a phone like with no cord? Huh? Oh. <laughs> well, uh, it's a straight phone. <laughs> like it is straight for 